Hello everyone, we are authorized to broadcast the content of the Ultimate Guide to America's Top Colleges, which is available for purchase on Amazon, welcome to order. Here is the content of the book. 3. Creating a Winning Application Crafting a winning application is an essential component of the college admissions process. In this section of The Ultimate Guide to College Admissions, we will provide readers with expert advice on how to create an application that stands out from the crowd and increases their chances of acceptance. This section will cover every aspect of the application process, from crafting a compelling personal statement to acquiring strong letters of recommendation and navigating the standardized testing process. We will also provide readers with tips for presenting themselves in the best possible light through their essays, resumes, and other application components. By following the strategies and advice provided in this section, readers will be able to create a well-rounded and compelling application that showcases their academic and personal achievements, as well as their fit with the institution. Whether you are a high school student just starting the college application process, or an adult learner looking to return to school, this section will provide you with the knowledge and tools you need to succeed. Choosing the right extracurricular activities. Extracurricular activities can be a significant factor in the college admissions process. Admissions committees look for applicants who have demonstrated a commitment to their interests, skills, and passions outside of the classroom. When choosing extracurricular activities, it's essential to consider the following. Passion. Choose activities that align with your interests and passions. Doing something you genuinely enjoy can help you stay committed and engaged in the activity. Diversity. Participating in a range of extracurricular activities can showcase a diverse range of skills, interests, and experiences. Consider joining clubs or organizations that challenge you to step outside your comfort zone. Leadership. Colleges value applicants who have demonstrated leadership skills. Consider taking on leadership roles within your extracurricular activities, such as being a club officer or team captain. Impact. Colleges are interested in applicants who have made a positive impact in their community. Consider participating in community service or volunteer work that aligns with your interests. Consistency. Consistency in your extracurricular activities is also important. Admissions committees look for applicants who have demonstrated a long-term commitment to their interests and passions. When choosing extracurricular activities, it's essential to remember that quality is more important than quantity. It's better to demonstrate a deep commitment to a few activities than to participate in many activities without showing any true passion or leadership. In addition to choosing the right extracurricular activities, it's also important to manage your time effectively. Participating in too many activities can be overwhelming and affect your academic performance. Balance is key, and it's important to find a healthy balance between your academic responsibilities and extracurricular pursuits. By carefully choosing and managing your extracurricular activities, you can demonstrate your commitment, passion, and leadership to college admissions committees and increase your chances of acceptance to top colleges and universities. Crafting a Compelling Personal Statement The personal statement is a critical component of the college application process. This essay provides applicants with an opportunity to showcase their personality, passions, and unique qualities to college admissions committees. When crafting a personal statement, it's essential to consider the following. Choose a topic. Many colleges provide applicants with a prompt or topic for their personal statement. Be sure to read and understand the prompt carefully and choose a topic that aligns with your interests, passions, and personal qualities. Showcase your personality. The personal statement is an opportunity to showcase your personality and unique qualities. Be authentic and allow your voice to shine through your writing. Be specific. Provide specific examples and details to support your claims. Admissions committees want to see evidence of your achievements, growth, and experiences. Use strong writing. The personal statement should be well-written, clear, and free of errors. 
Use strong vocabulary, sentence structure, and grammar to convey your message effectively. Tell a story. The personal statement should tell a compelling story about your experiences and personal qualities. Use anecdotes and narratives to engage the reader and create a memorable impression. Edit and revise. The personal statement should be carefully edited and revised to ensure it is polished and effective. Allow ample time for feedback and multiple drafts. Remember, the personal statement is an opportunity to showcase your personality and unique qualities to admissions committees. By choosing a compelling topic, showcasing your personality, providing specific examples, using strong writing, telling a story, and editing and revising carefully, you can create a personal statement that sets you apart from other applicants and increases your chances of acceptance to top colleges and universities. Navigating the standardized testing process. Standardized tests, such as the SAT and ACT, are often required by colleges as part of the application process. These tests are designed to evaluate an applicant's academic abilities and provide a standardized measure for colleges to compare applicants. When navigating the standardized testing process, it's important to consider the following. Research requirements. Before beginning the testing process, research the specific standardized testing requirements for each college on your list. Some colleges require the SAT or ACT, while others may have made these tests optional. Choose a test. Decide which test to take based on your strengths and weaknesses, as well as the requirements of the colleges you are applying to. Consider taking practice tests to determine which test is a better fit for you. Create a study plan. Develop a study plan that fits your learning style and allows you to prepare effectively for the test. Consider using study materials, tutoring, or online resources to help you prepare. Take the test. Schedule the test early enough to allow for retakes if necessary. On test day, arrive early, bring all necessary materials, and be prepared to focus and perform your best. Submit scores. Once you receive your test scores, submit them to the colleges on your list. Some colleges allow you to choose which scores to submit, so be strategic about which scores you send. Consider retakes. If you're not satisfied with your scores, consider retaking the test. Many colleges accept super scores, which means they take the highest score from each section of the test, regardless of which test date it was achieved on. Remember, the standardized testing process is just one component of the college admissions process. While it's important to perform well on these tests, admissions committees also consider other factors such as academic performance, extracurricular activities, and personal qualities. By preparing effectively, choosing the right test, and submitting strong scores, you can increase your chances of acceptance to top colleges and universities. Acquiring Strong Letters of Recommendation Letters of recommendation are a critical component of the college application process. These letters provide college admissions committees with valuable insight into an applicant's character, work ethic, and achievements. When acquiring letters of recommendation, it's essential to consider the following. Choose the right recommenders. Choose recommenders who know you well and can speak to your academic and personal qualities. These may include teachers, coaches, mentors, or employers. Ask early. Give recommenders ample time to write the letter, typically at least four to six weeks before the deadline. Be polite and respectful when asking, and provide them with any necessary materials, such as your resume or personal statement. Provide context. Provide your recommenders with context about your college goals, academic interests, and personal qualities. This can help them write a more targeted and effective letter. Follow up. Check in with your recommenders a few days before the deadline to ensure they have submitted the letter. Be sure to thank them for their time and effort. Consider additional letters. Consider acquiring additional letters of recommendation such as from a coach or community leader. These letters can provide a broader perspective on your achievements and personal qualities. 
Remember, letters of recommendation provide college admissions committees with valuable insight into your character and achievements. By choosing the right recommenders, asking early, providing context, following up, and considering additional letters, you can acquire strong letters of recommendation that showcase your potential and increase your chances of acceptance to top colleges and universities.